Hey, what's up, guys? This is Pez, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install the Linux OS 17 Android 10 in OnePlus 7. So, before proceed, if you have a subscriber, subscribe us and also hit the bell icon to get notified on all of our videos. Now, if you're done it, let's get started. Now, first of all, let me show you the device I'm using is OnePlus 7, which is running on Android 10. Now, if you want to install Linux OS 17 in OnePlus 7, your device should be running on Android 10. If your device is not running on Android 10, if your device is running on Android 9 or something, then first of all, you need to upgrade your device to Android 10. So once your device is running on Android 10, then you need to go to link in the description and you have to download all these four files. You can download all these four files and just copy these files in your SD card or your internal storage or uh, you can also copy all this file in your PC. Now I'll suppose you already have TWRP recovery installed on your device. If your device doesn't have any TWRP recovery, then just you can go to link in the description and you can find this video. And you can just follow this video to install TWRP recovery in OnePlus 7. And once you have TWRP recovery installed on your device, then come back to this video and watch this video continue from here. And for this video, I'm gonna just suppose you already have TWRP recovery installed. I'm not gonna show you again how to install TWRP recovery. So I'm gonna suppose you already have TWRP recovery installed on your device. So once you have TWRP recovery installed on your device in OnePlus 7, then just boot your device into TWRP recovery. Now, once your device is in TWRP recovery, now first of all, you have to uh, wipe everything from your mobile. So make sure that you already have a wake up of all your important data, including contacts and everything, internal storage. So here you just have to go for the format data and here you need to type yes and uh, click continue and that's it. It will wipe everything from your device and make sure you already have wake up of all your important data. And do not uh, do factory reset or do not do advanced wipe or anything else. You just need to do format uh, data. So make sure do not go for advanced wipe or do not do factory reset. Just go for the format data and that's it. I recommend you to do format data cause otherwise your device may be stuck in boot loop or something. So format data is recommended. Now here you can see that uh, in my internal storage there is no file cause I already uh, I just format my internal storage. So now you can connect it mobile with your PC and or you can also use SD card. If you already have all those files in your SD card, then it would uh, it's OK. You can proceed now. But if you don't have any files to flash, you can just use your uh, PC to copy all this file from your PC. You can download all this four file in your PC and you can just access your internal storage by booting your mobile in TWRP recovery and you can just paste all those files in your internal storage. So once you have all those files in your internal storage or your SD card, just go to install. Now here you have to select your ROM. Uh, first of all, you have to fl uh, flash lineage OS file. Uh, sorry for this bloody video. Uh, my camera was on auto focus mode. Sorry for that. Now, first of all, here you have to select your lineage OS 17 and that's it. Uh, it will take time. So wait until it's done. Now once it's done, uh, go back to again home menu and then again go to install. Now here you have to flash GFs. There are so many versions of GFs available over the internet. You can go for the official GFs, you can go for the unofficial GFs. But for now, I found this uh, Pico uh, open GFs file for ARM64 devices and I'm going to flash it. You can use any GFs available. You can do your own research. You can find uh, if you can find some other GFs, then just go for it and flash it. So once you flash GFs, then again uh, go to home menu and flash TWRP. And you need to flash TWRP recovery because uh, once you flash your ROM, TWRP will go on a wipe automatically. So it is very recommended to flash uh, TWRP uh, after flashing ROM file and GFs file. So once TWRP recovery is installed, you have to reboot your device. Just click on reboot system and your device will be rebooted. It may take up to five to seven minutes max. So wait until uh, your device boot successfully. So once your device booted successfully, you have to set up your device. Now, if you want to root your device, you can again boot your device into TWRP recovery and flash magic file. And that's it, your device will be rooted. Uh, for now, I'm gonna skip the routing part. And now here you can see that our device is booted. And here we have Lineage OS 17. Now, first of all, let me give you a quick overview of this ROM. Now here you can see that you have options for network and internet settings. You have connected device setting, you have apps and notification. You got some customization option under display setting. 
and here you have dark theme option also available and uh, you got all the basic feature and basic thing in this room but uh, you know what this room is still under development so it is very buggy and sometimes you don't find it is quite a handful as a one plus seven stock room is and i'm waiting for pixel experience room but for now this is what we have in this lineage os room here you have also navigation gesture option and so many other things basically got all the basic things but there is one problem with, with this room now after flashing this room i noticed that uh, there is no such application called play store even there is no google apps installed in this room and that may be because of gifs i flash uh, open gifs uh, pico arm 64 bit uh, gifs package uh, you may need to install some other gifs package if you can find some other gifs package officially or or unofficially you can just flash it i think this problem is because of gifs if you if you can find some other gs package then you can install it uh, the procedure will gonna remain same uh, you have to flash the rom you have to uh, flash the gs and that's it but i flash this pico gs i didn't find any play store application here so if you can find some other gs just then just flash it and that's it so guys that's it for this rom i hope you like this video and in future i will gonna upload more videos related to one plus seven i'll show you uh one installation of other rom videos also so guys that's it for this video i hope you like it don't forget to do subscribe and also the bell icon to get notification about all future videos this is the page sign out meet you soon in next video